Hey guys, welcome back to Lance's video, and today I am back playing Poppy Playtime. Yes, that's right. Now, in the last video, oh, I got the red hand and already, so I, I'll try to be less quiet than I was last time. But um, I actually did found the orange tape. Yeah, see, there it is. I searched it up. Alrighty, let's see what this tape has to say. Say for us. Alrighty. Um, wait, where? Oh, oh, I'm an idiot. I just passed it. Alrighty, let's see here. Hmm. Rich, where are they keeping the huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Remember when maintenance last did a sweep of this place? <laughs> no. Exactly! Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program and all on brand. But, uh, it's just hard to be happy about it when manufacturing's on our necks about it, because we can't find stupid hockey boxes! Rich. Oh, you're right. You're right. It's... It's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. Anything less would be more habitable. Is... Is that even a word? Habitable. Ooh. Okay. I don't understand. Alrighty. What are these tapes supposed to mean, actually? Alrighty. Alright, so let's try Artie. Red hand. Crouch. Just keep running. Oh, slide down. Ooh. Ooh, okay. I was actually practicing a bit on this game. Um, this actually ain't the same server as the game I played last time. This is a different one because I actually have been practicing. Alrighty. There's the other one and... There we go. Oh, oh. stop. My hand. My hand. My hand. My hand. Alrighty. I'm not even moving right now, I'm just... See, look, my hands aren't even on the keyboard. Oh! Uh, what? Oh! Why are the toys keep dropping? Oh no, this is gonna be another one. Hey! Oh! There we go. Oh wait, are we making a toy now? What is this called? Make a friend or something? Uh, oh yeah, make a friend. Alrighty. Need power. Well, I could probably start it without power, right? Uh. Okay. I think we're gonna need one of those SpongeBob time grip cards. Two and a half hours later. I'm not gonna pull it. I'm not gonna pull up an image. I'm just mostly gonna do the voice, that's all. Alright, so. Ooh, another tape! Ah. Uh, what are these tapes supposed to mean? Um, oh. Okay. Alright. Alright, but go. Um, my. It's like my hand's stuck, everyone. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh. Oh, there's the tape! How is it? Wow! Who placed Who are placing these tapes? Alright, let's see what this one has to say. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And... Being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, 
because adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult, but your body just gets older and older, and then you die. Poof! <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things, though, like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than the person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something. Right? All right, I think we're getting a little off track. Okay, I still don't know what that means. I'm mostly a FNAF guy, not a poppy playtime, but mostly play mostly people seeing play but mostly when I see people playing poppy playtime it make me want to play it already already I figured out how to do this already right, so. grab this back There we go. That's how you do that. Okay, it's a race. Oh, a race of the yellow parts. Um, oh, E. Oh, okay. Oh, there you go. Hold these. Alrighty, and there we go. Now this might take a few minutes, I don't think we need another Spongebob time for this part. Alright, three minutes later. Alrighty. Oi. Am I seriously gonna- okay. Alrighty. Oh. Oh, okay, you know, let's kinda turn that up to like 20. Alright. Oh, is that- I mostly learned most of the, um, top playtime characters because, um, I've been mostly playing Chapter 2. Oh, I forgot to mention, I have Chapter 2. I might play it on the channel, but actually I've been practicing on it too. The Wax Woogies is a pain, I'm never doing that again. Well, maybe. I don't know, I might play Chapter 2 on the channel. Oh, sorry guys, that's, uh, sorry, that's my dad, sorry, uh, someone just texted me, so, Cappy, give me that, sword, oh, what did I just hit? Okay, place the cat key right there. Alrighty. Alright, so good. Now... Alrighty, so go the... Ah! Oh, dear God. Ah! No! Ah! Anything but huggy! Ah! Oh! Oh, I just saw him. Oh! Hey! No! Ah! Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda of getting scared now. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda of getting scared now. Ah! No! Ah! Hurry, hurry, hurry! Ah! No! It can't end like this for me. Ah! I am going slow! No! Ah! Where's the box? Where's the box? Ah! Oh! Whoa! Bye bye, Huggy!
Jeez, that is a long drop. You think you can? You think anyone could survive that? I don't think anyone could. Do you think he's alive? I don't know. But a that didn't. Boy, I had to deal with Huggy for a short amount of time. Wow, that was fast. Oh, tape. Alrighty, and another tape player right here. Is this one not gonna make sense either? Okay, what's this one? Alright, let's turn that Final back up. In relation, experiment 1006. The prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. That's why I'm making this log, so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of... Okay, that still doesn't make sense. Hold on. Okay, that still doesn't make sense. But, um, all that matters is I'm getting close to the end of the game. Well, chapter one, of course. What the? That's kind of brutal, don't you think? Well, they're toys, but... Alright, so let's see here. Run, go back. No, stop. No, run. Danger, turn around. No, and stop. And I think that one says stop. At right there. Alright. Let's get Poppy now. Alrighty. Cherry boy! Oh. I Apparently I can't run while going down the stairs. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Ooh, a door. Ah. Stupid drawer. Or closet, whatever. Ooh, house. Ooh, house. I'm not gonna play with it. I. I can't move it? These pillows? What? Oh, wait. Did I just... Yeah, I can move pillows. Barely. Alrighty. Let's go save Poppy! Oh. Ooh. Poppy playtime. Wah! You opened my case. Ooh. The end of chapter one. Now, chapter one was actually kind of easy, especially when you don't have to deal with Huggy that much. But, um, in chapter two, we have to deal with Bunzo, a bunch of Huggies, Mommy Long Legs, and PJ Pug Pillar. And it's been mostly at, at the whole point of the game. And those are the only people who can jump scare us in chapter 2. I mean, like, chapter 1, you mostly get jump scared by Huggy. And, wow. I'm not gonna lie, crawling through the fence actually really scared me. I'm not gonna lie. But, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And, um, I guess that's the end of Poppy Playtime Chapter 1. I might play Chapter 2 in the future. Alrighty, as soon as these credits can end, I can- Oh! As soon as these credits can end, I can start- I can end the video. Right there. Wait. Alrighty. Ooh, 14 minutes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed me playing Poppy Playtime. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!